When the Canon EOS R3 first launched in 2021, it immediately felt like a camera designed with sports and wildlife photographers in mind, addressing the needs of shooters who miss the balance, authority, and reliability of Canon's legendary 1D series. Handling the R3, even briefly, leaves a strong impression, it feels purposeful, substantial, and engineered for serious performance. Its presence communicates that it's not a casual tool, it is a professional instrument built to excel under demanding conditions. Fast forward to today, and attention is shifting toward what comes next in Canon's professional mirrorless lineup, the Canon EOS R3 Mark II. Early information, leaks, and speculation are beginning to form expectations, providing a glimpse of what might follow. This discussion aims to explore those expectations, covering everything from sensor direction and processing improvements to autofocus evolution, shooting experience, and ergonomics. Timing is an essential factor in understanding the Canon EOS R3 Mark II. Canon historically aligns major professional announcements with high-profile sporting events, and with the 2026 Milan Olympics approaching, this period could serve as an ideal launch window. The current EOS R3 has been on the market for more than four years, a considerable lifespan for a performance-focused camera. Since 2021, the mirrorless camera landscape has shifted dramatically. Sony has advanced global shutter technology, Nikon has refined stacked sensor performance, and Canon itself responded with the R1 to compete in the ultra-high-end segment. The natural question arises, where does the R3 Mark II fit in this evolving landscape, and how can it evolve without encroaching on the territory established by the EOS R1? The answer lies in balancing incremental but meaningful upgrades while preserving the R3's core identity as a speed-first, reliability-focused professional body. One of the most telling indicators of the Canon EOS R3 Mark II's intent comes from its sensor. The original EOS R3 was equipped with a 24-megapixel stack CMOS sensor, a choice that prioritized readout speed, minimal rolling shutter, and consistent performance during fast-moving action, rather than chasing headline resolution numbers. Similarly, early expectations suggest the R3 Mark II will continue to emphasize speed over sheer pixel count. This makes sense within the R3 lineage, fast readouts, reliable burst performance, and minimal rolling distortion are critical for photographers covering fast action in sports or wildlife. There is even growing speculation about a global shutter-style approach, or a hybrid solution that mimics its benefits. From a practical perspective, such an enhancement could address issues like flickering LED lighting in stadiums or distortion caused by rapid movement, which have long challenged fast action shooters. Beyond sensor design, high ISO performance remains a priority. The original EOS R3 impressed professionals with its ability to deliver usable files well beyond ISO 12800, an essential feature for low-light sports arenas and wildlife environments. The Canon EOS R3 Mark II is expected to maintain or even improve this characteristic, ensuring that photographers can capture critical moments without compromising image quality. Additionally, moderate resolution helps preserve burst depth and buffer stability, elements crucial when photographers cannot afford to miss decisive frames. Speed, consistent performance, and reliability have always defined the EOS R3 series, and these attributes appear central to the Mark II iteration as well. Of course, sensor performance is only part of the equation. Processing power plays an equally critical role in translating raw data into usable images under demanding conditions. Canon's current Digic X processor, while powerful, is showing its age in certain high-speed and AI-driven tasks. The introduction of the Digic Accelerator helped to address AI-related workloads, yet the core imaging pipeline remains dependent on older architecture. A refreshed processor in the R3 Mark II would allow smarter noise management, smoother tonal transitions, and faster autofocus calculations, all of which directly improve the user experience during real-world shoots. Sports and wildlife photography often involve complex, unpredictable subjects against busy or distracting backgrounds. A more intelligent processing pipeline reduces the cognitive load on the photographer, enabling them to focus on composition rather than compensating for technical shortcomings. Shooting experience and ergonomics are another area where the Canon EOS R3 Mark II could shine. The viewfinder is a critical tool during extended shooting sessions, and reports suggest that the R3 Mark II will feature an upgraded 5.76 million dot OLED EVF, similar to the one found in the EOS R1. Tuned for low latency, smooth refresh, and comfort during prolonged use, this viewfinder is expected to improve tracking of fast-moving subjects and reduce eye fatigue, a significant advantage when monitoring athletes or wildlife for extended periods. Complementing this, Canon's iControl AF 2.00 could further elevate the shooting experience. 
With more sophisticated AI logic, the camera may better handle complex and crowded scenes, such as a full sports field or a flock of birds in flight. Eye Control AF allows the photographer to guide focus with their eyes while the camera executes rapid and intelligent adjustments, making high-speed shooting feel more intuitive and less exhausting. While still photography is the primary focus of the EOS R3 series, hybrid shooting demands are rising. Professionals increasingly need reliable video capabilities alongside stills. The Canon EOS R3 Mark II is expected to address this with high-resolution internal recording and professional codecs optimized for long sessions. Stability, heat management, and predictable performance are likely to take precedence over flashy but non-essential features. High frame rate 6K video options could appeal to agencies or content creators who require both motion clips and still photography without carrying multiple cameras. Maintaining Canon's consistent color science across both still and video modes will streamline workflow and save time during post-processing, an essential factor for professionals under tight deadlines. Resolution has always been a point of discussion in this category of cameras. Some shooters desire higher megapixel counts for greater cropping flexibility, while others prioritize speed and responsiveness above all. The Canon EOS R3 Mark II must strike a delicate balance. Too much emphasis on resolution could compromise burst performance or autofocus speed, undermining the camera's purpose. Observing competitors provides context, Sony separates its high-resolution and high-speed cameras clearly, while Nikon blurs the lines but defines roles effectively. Canon has a tendency to overlap its product lines, offering flexibility but requiring clarity about the purpose of each model. For the R3 Mark II, its raison d'etre is likely to remain speed and reliability above all. Ergonomics and build quality are equally critical. The original R3 felt dense and dependable, and the Mark II will likely continue this tradition. Features like weather sealing, shutter durability, and balanced handling with RF Super Telephoto lenses matter more to professional shooters than cosmetic refinements. Muscle memory is essential for photographers who spend hours tracking action across a field or jungle, and Canon understands that maintaining familiar ergonomics is key to preserving the R3's usability. A modest price increase seems probable, with mid to high $7,000 ranges appearing realistic for a professional body of this caliber. For working professionals, cost is secondary to trust, a camera that performs consistently and reliably is worth the investment. In summary, the Canon EOS R3 Mark II promises to be a carefully considered evolution of an already exceptional camera. By prioritizing burst speed, intelligent autofocus, refined processing, high-quality viewfinders, and ergonomics that cater to long hours in the field, Canon aims to reinforce its reputation for professional-grade reliability. The sensor may focus more on performance than megapixels, maintaining excellent low-light capability and buffer stability. Video options are likely to support hybrid workflows, while the body's design ensures comfort, durability, and seamless handling of large telephoto lenses. For sports, wildlife, and action photographers, the Canon EOS R3 Mark II represents a continuation of Canon's philosophy, tools that empower the photographer to capture decisive moments, day after day, without compromise.